So let me thank Senator Carper for uh, leading the charge uh, on this important legislation, bringing us in common cause for a common challenge with a very, with a very appropriate common solution. You know, the solution is, as uh, Senator Carper says, within the ambit of that which exists already. You just have to enforce it. Uh, it's exactly the type of uh, bold, decisive action we need to ensure a safer, more sustainable climate and a more prosperous future. Uh, back at home in uh, New Jersey, the threat of climate change is all too real and the cost of inaction is far too high. The Jersey Shore is a national treasure and our vibrant coastal communities are the heart of our thriving tourism and fishing industry. But we have seen the consequences of climate change through the brutal uh, natural disaster like Superstorm Sandy, the worst the state ever faced. Uh, and uh, Northeasters uh, are more common than ever before, more consequential than ever before. We've witnessed the consequences of rising sea levels, and we understand that we need climate action, and we need it now. Whether it's extreme flooding, severe droughts, or record-breaking wildfires, we know the climate crisis spares no one. It's truly a global crisis. Even President Trump's Department of Defense gets it. Last year, they published a report that said about 50 percent of DOD sites face current risks from climate change and extreme weather events. And as a ranking member in the Senate Foreign Relations Committee, Ben Cardin serves with me as a senior member on that committee, we've been long concerned about climate change's role as a threat multiplier, exacerbating conflicts, creating greater instability, and humanitarian crises around the world. If people have to flee because of climate change, if they cannot eat because of climate change, the type of instability that we are concerned about grows dramatically. Uh, but we're not powerless. That's the one message I think today. We're not powerless. We have a roadmap. We have a blueprint. Uh, and I think the Clean Economy Act uh, will help us get to where we need to be so that when we leave, we are not only good stewards of the planet, but we can look at future generations and say we did the right thing.